Hi everybody, this is Momo and we're going to be making another card today using the Creator Critter cartridge. And we're going to start off with our card base. And it's hot pink. This card is actually uh, going to be for Sarah since she won my um, giveaway for my 300 subscribers. Um, I'm making this card to go out with her package for her paper stack, which by the way, Sarah, I'm going tomorrow to Michael's to see if they already inventoried it. Okay, and I'm gonna use some scrap polka dot paper and I'm using this um, this paper. It's by um, DCWV and it's uh, the, I think it's the nature, the green stack and it's just a wood grain. And this is a new punch that I got. It's by EK Success. I got it at Michael's. All their punches are 40% off, so I was really excited. And I've been eyeing this one for a long time. Okay. Perfect. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and adhere this down to our polka dot paper. And I think I'm going to trim a little bit of this off. I thought I wanted it that thick, but I don't. I think I'm going to do... No. Let's see. That's about one and a quarter. Yeah, one and a quarter is perfect. Okay, perfect. And we're just going to go ahead and adhere this down. And the little critter that I'm going to be cutting out is the owl. And I'm doing it because, at least from what I can see on Sarah's videos, she loves owls. So that's the uh, reason why I picked the owl um, to do for her. Because I just figured that she really likes them. And it's plus it's super cute. I love that it has little eyelashes, which you guys will see in just a second. Um, I'm going to use this big ribbon. I got this big ribbon for something else, but I'm going to use it, um, to do my bow. Okay. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to, let me see. I'm going to adhere, um, Here, this part to my card base just to give me a little more support for the bow which you guys have seen me do quite a bit it's just easier especially when you're doing an actual bow and not just a knot it's easier if you um, like just place this kind of where you want it and I do want it to a side so okay I think I'm gonna do it there and then I'm just going to adhere this down. Perfect. Okay. And then we're going to attempt to do our bow. I'm going to try to do it live without cutting it. That may not happen, but I will definitely try. I think I did this too short on one side. actually cut it too short but I'm gonna see okay. okay so there's our bow and I'm just gonna I'm just gonna trim this at an angle just trying to do it carefully since it's such a long piece I just want to make sure that I get it done right and then we're just going to burn off our edges just so that it doesn't fray. By the way, all the ribbon at Michael's and, um, is 60% off. It's unbelievable. I mean, I got like eight spools of ribbon for like a dollar, dollar twenty. So it was a pretty really, it was a pretty good deal. Okay, so there's our, our um, card base. And then here's our little owl. Isn't he just stinking adorable? 
we're going to go ahead and put him together in all his little layers. And I'm just going to use some snail since it's a pretty big piece. I'm just lining him up. And I wanted him to be really bright and fun and funky, which is why I picked all these bright colors. And um, for this part, I'm just going to use some quick dry scotch. Oh, it squirted on me all over my mat. What do you hate when that happens? Okay. That's what I get for gluing stuff on my mat. Okay. And just gonna line this up. I'm just taking out some of the extra adhesive. Is he so cute? And then we have some itty bitty pieces, which are just a little beak and the little feet. Which I don't even I think I'm gonna do it with um with a zig just in case. Because it's really small. about which one I was going to do and then I just kept coming back to the little owl because I don't know why when I see an owl I think of her and I think it's because of all the cute cards that she makes with the owls so I just I don't know why I just always think of her okay so there's our little owl and then I was thinking since I didn't put my little uh, bow or my little flower or anything on my um on my little piggy the, um yesterday I wanted to do something for this one so I'm gonna put this little flower in her hair. I guess, I don't know what owls have. <laughs> but I think it's, no, feathers, duh, they're birds. Sorry guys, blonde moment. So isn't that super adorable? And we're just gonna go ahead and pop dot her right there. Ooh, this one came out cute, I'm so excited. And we're just gonna put some pop dots. And then I have one more thing, and then we'll be done with our card. Do, 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 do. Okay. And we're just gonna put her right there. And we're just gonna kind of adjust our little bow a little bit here. I used a really thick ribbon. But I just thought it would look really cute. Okay. And then we have our little conversation bubble and all the cuts are all from um, the Creator Critter cartridge. So this is a conversation bubble. And we're gonna stamp, I have a little stamp um, that I got. And it says, you're the best. Super cute. And all we're gonna do is put some pop dots on this and we're gonna put it right on our card like our little owl is telling Sarah you're the best and adjust here and that's it that's our card I hope you guys enjoyed it Tomorrow, I'm going to be making the kitty cats. Um, that was something that one of my viewers requested was that I make the kitty cat from the Creative Critter. So that's the one that I'm going to be making tomorrow. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's card. Um, I really enjoyed it. I think it turned out super adorable, more than I actually thought, um, like cuter than I actually thought it was going to be. So I'm really excited. So Sarah, this one's going out to you with your prize. Um, and that's it. Thanks, everybody, for watching, and stay tuned. Bye.